Kulfi, an exotic cross in desert, is undoubtedly one of the best sweet treats that the Indian subcontinent has to offer to the delicacies of the world. Today, I'm very excited to be making some kulfi for you. So let's get started. You need to start off by pouring in 8 cups or 2 litres of milk into a heavy bottomed pan. 1 can of condensed milk. One cup milk powder, you need to mix this all up together. One of the secrets to making great kulfi is to use top quality ingredients. So you need to use full cream milk here. And the other secret is the right amount of caramelization of the milk. Once all the ingredients are properly mixed together, you need to raise the heat to medium and allow the milk to come to a rolling boil. Once the milk comes to a rolling boil, you need to turn down the heat and allow the milk to cook for about 25 to 30 minutes. So while you enjoy your music, don't forget to keep stirring in between to prevent the milk from sticking to the bottom of the pan. As the milk continues to thicken, I'm going to stir in about 4 tablespoons of sugar. After the sugar dissolves into the milk, I'm going to put in some cardamom powder made from the seeds of about 8 to 10 cardamom pods, some nutmeg powder. Mix it up together and then I'm going to pour in a little full of the milk into the spice mixture and mix it up together. If you add the cardamom powder directly then it might form into lumps which will be difficult to disintegrate into the milk. I'm going to stir this back into the milk. Mix it up together. The milk is now thick and smooth and has acquired this beautiful caramel color. After the milk cools down, you can pour the thickened milk into kulfi molds and freeze till set. It should take about 6 to 8 hours for the kulfis to set properly. This kulfi is soft, creamy and luscious and to simply put it in one word, it is irresistible.